Hey folks. So, I just came home from work, and as I was driving home, the song Original Sin that was on the radio by In Excess. And it's a, it's a good song. It's a classic. And, of course, we all know the song is about how, uh, well, racism will always try and keep people separated. And, well, uh, like it says, but dream on, white boy. Dream on, black girl. Because, yeah, it'll probably never, never, ever happen that, uh, well, racism will not exist anymore. Which is a fucking shame. And as I was thinking about it, then, I was thinking, like, those poor naive bastards, because in this day and age, because this is the brand new day we have woken up to, and now, the whole racism thing, it's all, it's all upside down now, because the white boy isn't just, uh, a white boy anymore. No, he is a um, a white, uh, heteronormative, cisgendered, oppressive, patriarchal, well, rapist and shitlord. By definition, simply because he's white. And the black girl is, well, of course, the eternal victim, the oppressed, the victim of the patriarchy, and. Underprivileged, of course, underprivileged, you gotta bring in privilege. I mean, holy crap. Back in the day, they couldn't even know how, how fucked up shit really was, was gonna get. How racism just would, <laughs> woo, would just explode, implode even. And because, of course, original sin. There is, of course, no greater original sin than being born a white, cisgendered, heteronormative male. The ultimate, the ultimate example and piece of the, the patriarchy. But then I was thinking, maybe that's the whole layer of the song that all these years we have missed. What if Michael Hutchins, back in the day, already foresaw how things would be? Maybe, maybe he already saw back in the... In, in the late 80s, he already saw visions of BuzzFeed and MTV. And he was so fucking distraught. And the, the, the idea of living in times like this, like now, were so unbearable to him that he offed himself. <laughs> I mean, think about it. Think about it. Just listen to that song in the whole context of, uh, well, modern racism. The whole privilege, social justice bullshit thing. It takes on a whole different context. There's a whole different layer to it that we never uh, that we never figured out. But yeah, we have woken up to a brand new day. Everybody, uh, have a great weekend.